In this problem, I'm asked to solve a radical equation algebraically. So in order to do that, I must first isolate the radical part. I'm going to start by subtracting 41 from both sides of the equation. That gives me 5 times the square root of 2x minus 4 equals negative 30. Then I'm going to divide both sides by 5 and I get the square root of 2x minus 4 equals negative 6. Now at this point the radical is isolated so I want to remove the radical and the way I remove a square root is by squaring both sides. Now squaring both sides is not what's called an equivalent operation in mathematics so it could introduce what are called extraneous solutions so that's why it's very important that we check at the end. So the square root inside and the square on the outside just gives us 2x minus 4. Negative 6 times negative 6 is a positive 36. If I add 4 to both sides, I get 2x equals 40. And if I divide both sides by 2, I get x equals 20. So this certainly looks like a viable solution, but once again, we must check back in the original, check our result. 41 plus 5 times the square root 2 times 20 minus 4 and let's continue 41 plus 5 times the square root 40 minus 4 41 plus 5 times the square root of 36. I'm just working with the left hand side here as you can see. 41 plus 5 times 6. So 41 plus 30 equals 71. Well this does not equal 11 which was what it should have equaled. Therefore there is no solution to the original equation.